New at 11, another family in Norfolk is demanding justice for their loved one. And God, we all need you. Tonight, a huge crowd gathered to remember 32-year-old Delisha Taylor in Calvert Square. Someone shot her and another person early Tuesday morning. This happened near the intersection of East Virginia Beach Boulevard and Tidewater Drive. Officers then found Taylor dead inside her car nearby along West Brambleton Avenue. And tonight, she's being remembered as a loving and caring person who also worked in health care. A mother today, she is almost heartless. She's in disarray, anguish, anger. I can assure you, when I heard about it, my daughter said, Daddy, that young lady only went to work. She went to work, she went to work, she went to work. This is not the answer. What about the future? Norfolk police say they found a man shot the same morning. He is expected to be okay. And this isn't the only case police are working. There have been several shootings in downtown Norfolk since the start of the year. Monday, a man was shot in the Eon district. One month before that, police say someone shot three people inside MacArthur Mall, killing one man. And on March 19th, five people were shot outside a restaurant on Granby Street. Three people were killed, including a Virginian pilot reporter. There haven't been any race arrests in any case, but police have identified a suspect in the MacArthur shooting. U.S. Marshals are offering a $5,000 reward for information leading to the arrest of Gary Moore. He's wanted for murder and malicious wounding. If you see Moore or know where he is, call the crime line. The number is 1-888-LOCK-YOU-UP. And you can also use the P3 Tips app, and you can remain anonymous on both.